there was a young woman who was never lucky in love. Every boyfriend she had either mistreated her or cheated on her. She was beginning to think she would never find a husband and worried that she would spend the rest of her life alone. Then, one day, she met a young man who swept her off her feet. He was kind, gentle, and caring. They began dating and gradually fell in love. When he asked her to marry him, the young woman was delighted. She immediately accepted. After the wedding, the couple moved into a little house in the suburbs and together, they began making a life for themselves. They had to work hard in order to make the payments, but they didn't mind because they had each other. The young woman was delighted with her life and thought her happiness would never end. One night she was waiting for her husband to come home from work. It was getting late and when he still hadn't arrived, the woman began to get worried. She called his mobile phone but there was no answer. Eventually she grew tired and decided to go to bed. As she drifted off to sleep, the woman had a horrible nightmare. In the dream, she saw her husband riding his motorcycle down a darkened road. Suddenly, he swerved into the path of oncoming traffic and crashed into a truck. She watched in horror as the motorcycle skidded along the road and the truck ran over her husband's body. In the twisted wreckage, she saw his mangled corpse lying in a pool of blood. She woke up in a cold sweat and her heart was beating fast. Oh my God, she cried. He's dead. He's dead. Sitting up in bed, she tried to calm herself down. Looking at the clock on her bedside table, she realized it was a little after midnight. Just then, she heard the familiar sound of her husband's motorcycle pulling into the driveway. As she listened closely, she heard the front door open and her husband's cheerful voice telling her that he was home. He started to explain why he was coming back so late, but the woman interrupted him. You're really late, she shouted from the bedroom. Why didn't you call? I was so worried. I thought you died in an accident. Downstairs, there was an eerie silence. She strained her ears to listen. Then, she heard her husband say, in a faint voice, So, you've made your choice then. Again, all she could hear was silence. The woman called her husband's name again and again, but there was no reply. She got out of bed and went downstairs, but the house was completely empty. Her husband was nowhere to be seen. Minutes later, the phone rang, and when she answered it, there was a policeman on the other end. I'm sorry to be the one to inform you, he said, but an hour ago, your husband was killed in a motorcycle accident, 